The family of 17-year-old Summer Moody is still by her side at USA Medical Center as the team fights for her life. That's where we find News 5's Lauren Vargas. He joins us now with an update on her condition. Lauren? That's right, Devin. Summer Moody still in critical condition here at USA Medical Center. No specifics coming out this morning as of her condition. The attorney says we may not know for 24 hours just how well she is doing, but he does say she is getting better. Now, yesterday, the mom said Summer Moody was unresponsive, making no voluntary movements. She was on a ventilator and a feeding tube. Now the family is just asking the community for their thoughts and prayers that Summer get better. Now, I can't can tell you their attorney says the family is very frustrated. They feel like Summer has been portrayed unfairly in this case when they when they say there is no proof that she did anything wrong at this point. They are hoping that the sheriff's office and the district attorney take a good look at all of the facts. Take a listen. We certainly have a lot of questions involved uh, about whether or not the use of deadly force uh, would have been appropriate under these circumstances. Um, what these men were doing out there when they were firing these shots whether or not alcohol was involved, um, whether or not these men put themselves in the zone of danger and created the situation. Again, her mother told us yesterday she couldn't tell us why her daughter was on Gravine Island at 4 o'clock in the morning. She said she had texted her that night and she expected her to be at a sleepover at a girlfriend's house in Bay Manette. Reporting live at USA Medical Center, Lauren Vargas, News 5.